let's let's have a fun song. Yes. Da, 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 the United States, Canada, Mexico, Canada. Panama, Haiti, Jamaica, Peru, Republic, Republic Dominican, Dominican, Cuba, Cuba Caribbean, Caribbean, Greenland, El Salvador, Salvador too. Do. Puerto Rico, Colombia, Venezuela, Honduras, Guiana, and still Guatemala, Bolivia, then Argentina, and Ecuador, Chile, Brazil, Costa Rica, Belize, Nicaragua, Bermuda, Barbados, Tobago, San Juan, Paraguay, Uruguay, Suriname, and French Guiana, Barbados, and Guam. Wow, I am looking at the lyrics. You know this, don't you? I know the first verse. That's as far as I know. Uh, okay, after that, the da 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 I- I accidentally muted you, I'm sorry. <laughs> We're playing Donkey Kong Country! Woo! 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 But, but the second one! Yeah, cause we never do the first one. Never! We and also because sequel. nothing else works! Woo! This yeah, is literally no. the third game we've tried to record today. Not to mention the second fucking time we've tried to record this game specifically. Yep! Oh my goodness. But well, hey, we don't have encoding fun. problems anymore. So that's fun. That's good. That that is well, good. Well, welcome everybody. <laughs> welcome. Welcome. So, uh, I already had my first experiences with this, so unfortunately no genuine reactions here. But I guess I'll just complain about the stuff I usually do. Which uh, is most things. Wow, I see how it is. <laughs> Hold on, I'm, 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 I'm gonna turn- I'm gonna turn up your volume a bit, because I think you're a bit... quiet? I could just scream! Uh, now we're good, I think. Alright, nah, look at the water, I do love the water. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Well, I guess they're going- just going over exactly what we said last- last time. Oh, yeah. And now that I've been told that I complain, I'm only gonna compliment this game. <laughs> only compliment. Wow, look at them monkeys. Mm. Diddy is definitely not darker <laughs> at all, shadow-wise. That's that's an artistic touch. He's mm. he is the Shadow Kong. Oh yeah. Oh look at the look at them sprites. Holy shit, it's beautiful. <laughs> okay, you can go back to your normal self. Wow, Sean. Wow. <laughs> I get it. Cool. Oh boy. Look, I <laughs> love that in between slide. Monkeys wrestle crocodiles all the time, it's fine. Yep. I'm trying not to use the word hate anymore. I just like being dumbfounded by everything in these games. <laughs> Look at this fucker. What <laughs> every single pirate has the same leg cut off. Every single one. They have a rat infestation that's clear as day that nobody is dealing with. And I saw this boat in half! Oh, no. <laughs> I saw this- I actually saw that- that infomercial on live television. I saw this, this boat, boat in half. half! I love that guy. Oh, he's the best. <laughs> I loved gravity there. <laughs> Rambi just- oh, uh, Rambo? No, it's Rambi. Rambi. Rambi just dropped like a rock. Fun fact, hippos actually sink. It's a lot of fun. They just like plop to the bottom. You are murdering so many innocent pirates. Uh, they're I mean, not innocent, they work for K. Rule. Alright, what's K. Rule's crime? He stole the bananas. He- he's- he looks too good as a pi- You're fucking kidding what? me. You're fucking kidding me. Did it just crash? No! Look- look down at the bottom of OBS in a, like a second. Where am I looking? Right, bottom right, right bottom left. Oh, now it's not showing up. It, it should be in the bottom left. Guarantee you, it's gonna show up in like five seconds, and I'm gonna I'm gonna scream. It's not showing up. Ugh. I hate when I hate I hate OBS. Are you okay? No, I'm not. I'm really not. 
Okay, hang in there, bud. Uh, <laughs> why can't I just record with, record fun stuff with my buddy? Oh, thank you, Sean. Uh, <laughs> so, did we just lose all that, or are we still going? No, we're still going because it hasn't shown up yet. Well, all right then. Hey, guys, sorry. <laughs> Okay, oh, I, that, I, oh I think God. I think this this entire this OBS is going to be the death of me. <laughs> oh my God, this is great. This is a great game. This is a great game. Those ropes were just floating in the air. This is great. That's an artistic choice. Oh my goodness, this. Is... <laughs> <laughs> I never noticed that. What? <laughs> They're just not attached to anything. <laughs> <laughs> They're just suspended in midair. Like, oh my god, you couldn't have just put like a wooden bar just stuck out slightly? Nah, you could. Oh, uh, whatever. Nope. Also, Dixie Con makes me sick every time I look at her. It's just. Oh, Why, though? When, you, when she spins, because I feel like I want to barf. Because, like, oh god, look at that. Oh, jeez. Also. Mentioning Dixie Kong Smash. Yeah. Would you want Dixie Kong and Smash? Um If she controlled differently from all the other Kongs, then yes. If she was on a clone, yeah. Yeah. See, you know who I would love in Smash, and this is probably like a very like I don't know. Not really I guess it's a weird choice. I want Captain Toad. Really? Yes. Okay, hear me. Uh, basically, this whole stem. I saw this weird video where somebody like did this 8-bit animation for like Smash Brothers, mm -hmm. and like, uh, I don't remember the name of it. Maybe pop it up if you find it. But regardless, it's like really, really. It's not even that good. But like the ending is like Captain Falcon versus Toad, and Toad gets this moment of like, I must believe in myself, and he turns into Captain Toad, and like. I love that game. It's a really charming game. I think it deserves more love. And like, it would be an interesting move set. It would be different. It's Toads, you know. It. Mm -hmm. I feel like that would be a really good random character, you know. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's just me. I'm like the only person on the planet that wants this, but I'd love that man. And the I I have a sneaking suspicion that like, the fact that Crash Bandicoot is coming to the Switch is an indication that he might be in Smash. Oh. Oh no! <laughs> You're not a fan of that. <laughs> no, because because I mean, like Crash for the longest time was the Mario to Sony. Yeah, it's really weird. I mean, but so was Sonic with the Sega, right? With the Sega. Oh my God. Yeah, but but by the time that that Sonic started appearing in Mario games, Sega was long out of the game. All right, I get you. Sony's still kicking, and the fact yeah. that like. It's kind of weird, isn't it, that, like, everybody at that time tried to make their own Mario? Yeah. Like, literally everyone, and I don't think any of them, like, long-term succeeded. Except Bubsy. Bubsy <laughs> yes, only... that's the one that succeeded. Yeah, I mean, they it recently had a revival, and I heard it was only good. <laughs> it was only good. It was only good, nothing else. What could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? Oh my god, my favorite is still the 3D game where they just <laughs> misunderstand the entire point of A, a 3D platformer, and B, a video game. <laughs> like, oh my god. How do you screw up so much that you don't even understand what a video game is? Uh, I could ask that to literally every single goddamn, like, m video game movie ever. Cause, like, none of them um, understand how video games should be, like, adapted. I said this once before and I'll say it again. They need to make a good one, but they're not gonna. Um, Silent Hill was okay. I'm gonna say that. Uh, Mario movie was a beautiful masterpiece. <laughs> Assassin's... Was the Assassin's Creed movie a thing? Did that come out? It did come out in 2016. It's Michael Fassbender wow. as I think whatever I think... assassin he was supposed to be. To was he supposed to be Ezio? I don't know. Also, that movie was so uneventful that I heard, like, nothing about it. Yeah. No, it, like, it, was, I, it was just bad. I just heard it came out, and then, like, I didn't hear any reviews, I didn't hear anyone talking about it, I forgot it existed, like, a minute later, like... Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I just completely forgot. Oh my god. 
Con. Look at that sunset. Mm. Love. Mwah. Beautiful. Mwah. 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 That's the music, by the way. I can never hear it. The music. Uh, it's it's your it's your typical David Wise soundtrack, so it's great. Oh, nice. Hey, you got all the con letters, which you're not time, right? Uh, yeah. Oh, we should establish that rule. This is mostly a hundred percent, but like. Yeah, no, it's it's gonna be completely a hundred percent because the con because oh, but... the con letters don't count for a hundred percent. Oh, really? All yep. Right, never mind then. Yeah, so all, all I need to do for 100% is get all of the bonus barrels and all of the DK medallions. DK medallions. Mm -hmm. The donkey call. See, they play it off like he isn't rich, but that man has got numerous pounds of gold and thousands upon thousands of bananas. <laughs> I think anyone with that much bananas must be rich. That's not anything. Lockjaw's locker. Mm -hmm. Wh who's Lockjaw? Uh, uh, he's a uh, lockjaw. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, good. I wasn't asking what he was, I'm asking who. Whom stidative. <laughs> These poor bastards, they have just lost. Ooh, there, there she goes. That's a bastard that killed Steve Irwin. Yeah? <laughs> Dude, oh. Steve Irwin was the best man. I remember yeah. waking up at 6 a.m. watching his show and being like, hell yeah, dude. Animals. <laughs> and now Animal Planet is garbage, because it's like, look, people and then occasionally pets. You, 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 know, you know what d definitely deserves to be on the Animal Channel? Show about making fish tanks. Oh, yeah, no, no. And I love every episode has the sing... A single scene, never longer than five minutes, about picking up, like, fish and actually talking about the animals. Like, 95% yep. of the show is actually, like, and just people hanging out. Yep. It's like, and then there's a ton of cop shows on there that are, like, pet cops, but not really, and it focuses way more on the people. Yeah. Like the and Rollies, which I think also focuses on people. Yep. It not only focuses on people, but also focuses on a not real thing i'm sorry but oh god look okay technically speaking bigfoot could be a possibility oh I'm not god gonna finding say it bigfoot a possible but yeah <laughs> and here's the thing as a kid i watched that like i remember watching it because i had this phase where like cryptids intrigued me because i'm like ooh, what if they are real you know mm -hmm. but like i never went to the point where i 100 percent believed in it but like looking back oh my god Oh my god. Oh my god. It's so bad, John. <laughs> like, they're not gonna reveal Bigfoot on cable television, you know no. what I mean? Like, yeah. they're never gonna find Bigfoot, you know what I mean? Like, yep. you're gonna hear about the discovery afterwards. Mm -hmm. uh, not even... Plus, the chances of the... Uh, I've already gone over the lock this month. Why don't we keep talking about cryptids? <laughs> because cryptids I've are cool! They are, but they're not real! Oh. The most famous ones probably are. Anyway, and then the last thing that broke this, but yeah, good point. The last thing that broke my back with Animal Planet was goddamn uh, Treehouse Masters, where the entire show's premise is like guys build tree houses for people who want tree houses. That's Real? It. What? There, there's no. I think I watched an episode with my dad because he likes construction shows, mm -hmm. and I like I I got so pit. <laughs> <laughs> this poor fish. <laughs> Mush slave. Alright, poor. <laughs> no fish zone. Oh my goodness. Hey. Recording for you. If you know the word. Oh god. This, this game is too 90s for me. What was I saying? <laughs> Literally, I think there's a scene in Treehouse Masters where, like, there was one shot of a squirrel, and then there was, like, the family had a dog that they showed, like, three times. Mm hmm. I'm gonna say it once and I'm gonna say it again, that's not how snakes work. <laughs> so, going back, going back to that, the show that really annoys me the most, though, is Ancient Aliens. Oh. But that's not that's history like, anyways. Oh yeah, no, that's not, we're moving on from Animal Planet. Uh, but the History Channel also isn't history anymore. Oh yeah, no, like, all those channels, they have this, like, just show, like, cool animal document or history documentaries, people are always itching to see them. Mm-hmm. But they're, like, stepping out. You should 
should not be a sh like a channel that's like going for the most views and the most popular shows. My God, you're called the History Channel. Yeah. Show history. Yeah. Like, stop it. Jeez. Oh my God. Look, Ancient Aliens too. My dad is one of those people that also like is totally into like those sort of conspiracy theories. Like, mm -hmm. he's not a hundred percent convinced the moon landing was a thing. And he watches oh, those shows, and he's like, "Oh, how did they? How did they make the pyramid? It's insane!" And I'm like, "Look, they slid the blocks up ramps." No, no, no. It's not even that. It's like when you talk about it, like Egypt existed for thousands of years before they even got close to starting to build pyramids. Yeah. And it's not like they got, came out of nowhere. The first pyramid was the shittiest, like, garbage thing you've ever <laughs> seen. Like trash really, pyramid. No, what they came from was kings like to be stormed in, like, tombs that were, like, mm -hmm. one story tall. And then somebody was like, what if we fucking put a tomb on top of a tomb? <laughs> and then they did that a couple times, and that was the first step pyramid of Egypt, and it's garbage. If you've ever seen it, it's literal garbage. Like, it's fallen apart, it's crooked, it's not right. And then they tried again. Tr tried to build a pyramid, and I believe that was the second one, and it was like a weird, like they fucked up halfway through building it so at one point it's one angle, and then it just changes angles, and <laughs> continues going. It's so fun. Oh, it's so awful looking. And then they tried again, and again, and eventually they managed to build the, like Giza, you know Yeah, the, I mean? like, the Great Pyramids Khufu's Pyramids Second of all, they didn't use slave. All the be all the people working on the pyramid were either paid worker or skilled engineers. You know what I mean? Mm. Like, there it's not like they just threw a bunch of slave labor at it. Like, and then it's like, how did they do that? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, and then, oh god, and then the final thing that like tittles my goat is the fact that like people <laughs> severely under it. Yeah, I'm never saying that again. <laughs> uh, Please say that again. <laughs> uh, uh, Another thing that tittles my coat <laughs> is, oh god, is that motherfucking, like, people underestimate the human species. They had thousands of years. Like, literally, the Egyptians were as ancient to the ancient Romans as the ancient Romans are to us. Like, yeah. thousands upon thousands of years with, like, hardly any conflict whatsoever. They just kind of existed. They, there was nobody to fight, you know what mm -hmm. I mean? Like. And they had no desire for expansion because that was their whole motto was like live by the river. Hey, that's a vulture pirate. That is a vulture He's pirate. She's throwing the young. She's throwing young at you. Oh god, what was they saying? Yeah, no, look, just don't underestimate the Egyptians. That's all I'm saying. Eggs <laughs> don't, don't under seem like a sufficient weapon. Don't underestimate the Egyptians. Don't underestimate the Egyptians, man. They're fucking insane, dude. No, you know what? Romans are the scariest thing. Yeah. Romans. Literally, they just kept going. Like, they just- they just kept going. <laughs> Nobody was there to stop them. There was, like, nothing they could do. Oh mm -hmm. my god, the second cars did fell, like, that was it. They just kept going. Yeah, after, after the Punic Wars, it's just, like, it's over for the rest of Europe. Yeah, no, and to be fair, there were some cultures that gave them trouble. Like, apparently, the- the- What culture? The Germans gave them a lot of trouble. Oh yeah, the Germanic uh, tribes definitely did. Yep, like, that was the area where they kind of started to struggle a bit, mm -hmm. expanding. Oh, uh, uh, did he? Did he? Oh, God! <laughs> You'll rock out, I'll spaz. <laughs> oh, God, should we end it here or not? Nah, but let's do one more level. Because cause I'm going faster than I was in the original. Oh, excuse me. Look at that. Crocodiles in the fucking lava. They don't care about heat. Is that a treasure chest? That is a treasure chest. Hey. Feed it to the children in the lava. It's a balloon. You got a life. Two lives. Okay, yep. green is two lives. Green is two lives, red is one, and blue, I think, is three. Interesting. Interesting. Oh my god, this is fun. This, this is, is fun. fun. Still, I love that the level project project. I just said it twice in a row. Progression is goddamn pirate ship followed by volcano. Yeah, this is great. This is a great game. Uh, you're gonna love some of even like some of the later levels after this, because the next what? world is swamp. And, swamp. And then the next one after that, amusement park slash beehive. 
And then Death World. <laughs> oh, okay, sure. Death World. Yep. What the fuck is Death World? It's all just horror-themed stuff. Like ghosts and goblins and whatnot. Alright. This is starting to scream to be the B team. Oh god. Oh god, I hate it. Uh, <laughs> I think you said I hate it when you saw Squitters last time. Because it's gross, it's hairy, and oh no, stupid spider, jeez. What was I saying? Wait, what What did that remind me of? Oh right, I watched Guardians of the Galaxy 2 and my dad actually liked it. Oh! Which he's usually not into crazy stuff like that where it's like too extreme, but he was like, nah, it was funny. And it's kind of weird, too, because he asked me if it was successful, and I'm like, yeah, it was successful, and then I thought about it for a minute, and I'm like, oh my god, that's a weird thought. Like, the fucking Guardians of the Galaxy were, like, the C team in the goddamn Marvel Universe. Like, X-Men were A team, Avengers were the B team, mm -hmm. and, like... I th I'd say Guardians were even lower than C team, because Fantastic Four, I would say, was the C team. Oh god, yeah. Okay, Fantastic Four and Avenger, depending uh, on what era, but like, Fantastic Four would shift. So yeah, Guardians were literally like D or E T material, and they have a multi-million dollar successful franchise, where the original head of Marvel is fucking in the gutter right now. Like, yep. It... Except, fucking Fox bought it. We keep bringing this up, but I just want a good Fantastic Four movie. But every uh -huh. time I bring this up, every time I bring this up to anybody I like that knows Marvel, like, three of my friends so far have been like, no, I don't want another Fantastic Four movie. I want, I know, I want a good Fantastic Four movie. It's just about time. Yeah. Also, it deserves it, man, after all that shit. Yeah. Like, I just want Victor Von Doom to be a good villain again. Not only a good villain, but a fucking good MCU villain that doesn't fucking die three minutes in. Like, yeah. Oh God. Like literally, he could be the next like Loki. Uh, if you mean antagonist that's through multiple movies, yes, agree. Yes. Uh, not in the term of Tumblr fangirlism, because I don't think Doctor Doom would be very good for that. Uh, isn't it? You'd be surprised, because look. As if they if they go with like what they did with the original one, where they had him be a, like a really handsome guy before oh, he was God. before he went underneath the whole doom outfit, it might doom. work. And then he started he started talking in the third person. Yeah. Okay, that's enough for today. Yes. Take care, everybody. Adios, muchachos. Arrivederci, muchachos. Derechi. Till my goat. All right, bye. Doom. Another thing that tiddles my coat. <laughs>